when it gets to the point that I need assistance to track all my favorite television shows, I may finally have to admit there is a problem. I currently follow over 20 active shows and without assistance, it's nearly impossible to keep tab of when episodes are airing or have aired. Also since I am a cord cutter, I watch very few shows live, so remembering which episode I stream last can at times be a challenge. If you are an avid fan of numerous TV series, you would probably want a platform that not only lets you keep track of all your favorite shows but also allows you to actually view reactions of other people to every episode. This is practically what you can expect from an entertainment app like TV Time that I'll be reviewing today. Excited? So let's get started. If you dedicate at least one hour daily to your favorite TV shows, it means you are an addict. I may spend months TV free but when something catches my eye, that inner poise is as good as lost and before I know it, I have bunch of shows on my list and no time nor intention to check out which station airs what or when. To keep things in order, I use an app known as TV Time which is not just a TV guide and personalized calendar for your favorite shows but also a vibrant community of users like yourself crazy about certain shows or all of them, more on that in a second. Now before we dive deep into the app, let's first quickly set things up. Once you initially open TV Time app, you are prompted to take a tour, log in or get started. You have the option to log in with a Facebook or Twitter account or sign up via email. If you go the route of getting started, you are presented with a list of shows to add to your watch list. Once that is finished, you will need to select the last episode or season you watched for each show and you are good to go. So now you have successfully created an account. Now let's talk about the design and UI. The design of TV Time is beautiful as it features a sleek interface that looks fantastic especially on the larger screen devices. TV Time puts a focus on the visual aspect of each show. Since each one has a bar that features poster artwork while providing basic information like the show name and when the next episode airs or whether it has already ended. Navigation in TV Time is simple as well. Since there is a full navigation bar at the bottom of the screen which consists of 4 tabs. The first tab shows the information regarding the upcoming shows. The second tab is for your watch list. The third tab will showcase the community reaction, trending article, podcast, etc. And the fourth tab is profile where you will find informations regarding your shows, stats and comments. Plus by swiping left you will get the notification and chat tab. Overall the app is sleek and makes great use of contrasting colors. Now let's move forward and talk about its features and functionality. TV time can be used exclusively as a TV show tracking utility. However, for those interested, it also features various social elements like you can befriend users and read their timelines. You can also send direct messages to your friend and discuss the episode privately or ask for advice on which show to watch next when you are done with your favorite ones. Following the people who are passionate about your favorite shows help you discover more shows that are in the same range of your interest. The community is bilingual in the least because the app originates from France. But if you would like to limit your experience to English only comments, you can tap English at the top of the comment section. In the For You tab, you will get all the socializing features like community reaction, quizzes, trending articles and podcasts. Among all these, community reaction feature is my favorite. From here you can access the community of your favorite shows. Here you will get to see the episode reaction from all over the globe. You can also post your own reaction by using a meme, gif, video or photo and it's really fun to share your thoughts and reaction with the community and get their feedback. The upcoming section shows you which episodes are due on the air soon with the dates, time and the station airing them. And that's really convenient because I always have problem in remembering the stations according to the shows. The watch list section features the episodes that were already watched and also shows what you are going to watch next. Now if you are not in hurry, you can walk the slow lane of following the users whose comments you like in the feed of your favorite shows and see what they are watching. There is a more straightforward search bar and a section of genre you can choose or all of them. By default the app displays the current trending ones so if you sign up this week, you will most likely see the stranger things on the front page. Overall, all the shows I was fond of were readily available and spotted quite a vibrant community of people sharing their impressions, so I felt included immediately. Besides, you can also discover all the show details you wanted from within the app as it's conveniently integrated with IMDB and Wikipedia. So when you tap on an actor, the app takes you to their bio page. Cool, isn't it? 
So after using this app for about a week, I think TV Time is the best app in its category. I love the variety of options available to find shows to track and the ease at which I can mark full season as watched without requiring several hundred taps. I also greatly appreciate the flexibility the app offers in the way of notifications. So if you like to watch lots of TV shows like me but having trouble in keeping track, then I will highly recommend you to try TV Time at least once. So guys that's it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you do then do consider subscribing to my channel for more future videos like this and don't forget to press that bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. So this is Samir signing off and I'll see you guys in my next one.